in less than two years, your daily life will look nothing like it does today. Not because of one massive invention, but because 20 different technologies are about to collide in ways that will completely rewrite the rules of work, health, and human connection. The experts aren't just predicting change. They're watching it unfold right now in labs, boardrooms, and pilot programs across the globe. What you're about to discover isn't science fiction. It's the blueprint for 2026, and it starts with something that's already making decisions without asking for permission. Right now, AI systems are evolving beyond simple chatbots into something far more powerful, autonomous agents that can think, plan, and act on their own. OpenAI, Google, and Anthropic aren't just testing these systems. They're deploying them in real-world scenarios where they complete complex workflows without human intervention. These agentic AI systems are already coordinating logistics operations, managing healthcare protocols, and making financial decisions. McKinsey's research reveals that this automation wave could transform 60 to 70% of current job activities. But here's what most people miss. It's not about replacing workers. These AI agents excel at handling the tedious, time-consuming tasks that bog down human productivity, freeing people to focus on creative and strategic work. While AI reshapes the workforce, two revolutionary technologies are racing toward breakthroughs that seemed impossible just years ago. Bioprinting has moved from concept to reality, with 3D printed skin and organ tissues entering clinical trials. Scientists can now print living tissue that functions like the real thing. Simultaneously, quantum computing has shattered previous limitations with IBM's 1,121 qubit Condor chip and Google's quantum algorithm solving problems that would take classical computers millennia. The bioprinting market alone is projected to exceed $4 billion by 2027 while quantum computing promises to unlock solutions in drug discovery and material science that could save millions of lives. But all this innovation comes with a hidden cost that's forcing the tech industry to confront an uncomfortable truth. AI workloads are consuming energy at unprecedented rates, with the International Energy Agency projecting that data center electricity use could double by 2026. The solution? Using AI to solve its own energy crisis. DeepMind has already slashed Google's cooling costs by 40% using machine learning, while grid operators worldwide are implementing AI systems to balance renewable energy sources, predict demand spikes, and optimize battery storage. The technology creating the problem is becoming essential to solving it. As virtual intelligence grows more sophisticated, physical robots are experiencing their own revolution. Tesla's Optimus robot folding laundry might have seemed like a publicity stunt, but it represents a fundamental shift in robotics. Japanese service robots are already caring for elderly patients, while John Deere's AI-powered tractors farm autonomously without human oversight. These aren't the repetitive assembly line robots of the past. They're adaptive machines that can handle unpredictable environments. The global robotics market is heading toward $200 billion by 2030, driven by AI that gives machines the ability to think and adapt in real time. The convergence of AI and biology is creating possibilities that blur the line between natural and artificial. DeepMind's AlphaFold has cracked the code on protein structures, accelerating drug discovery timelines from decades to years. Isomorphic Labs partnered with major pharmaceutical companies throughout 2024, using AI to design new medicines at speeds previously thought impossible. But medicine is just the beginning. AI-designed enzymes are being tested for creating biodegradable plastics and sustainable food production, promising solutions to environmental challenges that have plagued humanity for generations. Nations worldwide have realized that AI isn't just technology, it's power. Countries are racing to build sovereign AI systems to maintain control over their data and digital infrastructure. France launched Mistral as an EU-backed alternative to American and Chinese models, while Saudi Arabia and the UAE have created massive sovereign AI funds. This isn't about technological pride, it's about digital independence. The EU has committed billions of euros to AI development, recognizing that relying on foreign AI systems poses risks to national security and economic sovereignty. The boundaries between physical and digital reality are dissolving faster than most people realize. Extended reality technologies, encompassing AR and VR, have moved far beyond gaming. Walmart has trained over 1 million employees using VR simulations, while Meta and Apple push mixed reality headsets designed for productivity. 
Virtual stores let customers try products before buying. Classrooms transport students to ancient civilizations, and remote workers collaborate in shared virtual spaces. By 2026, these technologies won't be novelties. They'll be as common as smartphones are today. Robots are leaving warehouses and entering public spaces at an accelerating pace. Amazon's Scout delivery bots navigate sidewalks, while Starship Technologies operates autonomous delivery fleets across college campuses. Seoul's subway stations employ cleaning robots that work alongside commuters. These aren't remote-controlled machines. They're AI-powered systems that map environments, avoid obstacles, and make decisions independently. The sight of robots sharing sidewalks and buildings with humans is becoming normal, not exceptional. Cities themselves are becoming intelligent organisms. Singapore and Barcelona lead the charge with sensors monitoring everything from traffic flow to air quality in real time. The Internet of Things is evolving into something more sophisticated, IoT 2.0, where billions of connected devices create adaptive environments that respond instantly to changing conditions. Global IoT spending is approaching $1.6 trillion, transforming infrastructure from static systems into dynamic networks that optimize themselves continuously. Behind the scenes, the entire technological infrastructure supporting AI is being rebuilt from scratch. NVIDIA's GPUs dominate today, but companies like Cerebras and Graphcore are creating specialized chips designed specifically for AI workloads. Cloud providers aren't just adding AI capabilities, they're redesigning storage, networking, and computing architectures around machine learning needs. This invisible revolution in AI native infrastructure is what makes everything else possible. The future of automation isn't about replacing humans, it's about collaboration. Collaborative robots, or cobots, work alongside people rather than instead of them. Universal Robots has deployed over 75,000 cobots worldwide in industries ranging from manufacturing to food service. These polyfunctional robots can switch between tasks rapidly, moving from assembly line work to healthcare assistance as needed. They represent a more flexible, human-centered approach to automation. Privacy concerns are driving a fundamental shift in how AI processes data. Apple runs generative AI models directly on iPhones, while Qualcomm builds chips optimized for local AI processing. This privacy-first approach means your health data, personal conversations, and sensitive information never leave your device. By 2026, on-device AI will be standard for applications requiring trust and security, giving users both speed and control over their digital lives. Generic AI is giving way to specialized intelligence. Medical AI assistants trained exclusively on clinical data outperform general models in healthcare settings. Financial services deploy compliance-focused AI that understands complex regulations. Logistics companies use AI agents optimized for supply chain management. These vertical AI agents represent a shift from one-size-fits-all solutions to domain-specific expertise that matches human specialists. AI integration into everyday tools has reached a tipping point. Microsoft Office includes Copilot as standard, Adobe Photoshop offers generative fill, and Google Workspace anticipates your needs before you express them. Soon, every productivity and creative tool will include AI capabilities as basic features. The distinction between AI-powered and traditional software is disappearing. Intelligence is becoming the default, not the exception. Brain-computer interfaces have crossed from science fiction into medical reality. Neuralink received FDA approval for human trials, while Synchron successfully implanted interfaces helping paralyzed patients regain communication abilities. Early consumer applications in gaming and communication are emerging. While mass adoption remains years away, the steady progress suggests a future where thoughts directly control technology isn't just possible, it's probable. Operating systems themselves are being reimagined around AI. Instead of apps and menus, future interfaces will center on natural language and automated workflows. Microsoft's deep copilot integration and experimental projects like Rabbit R1 preview this shift. By 2026, the way we interact with devices, from laptops to cars, will be fundamentally different, with AI as the primary interface rather than an add-on feature. The cloud computing revolution is experiencing an unexpected reversal. Rising costs and security concerns are driving companies to bring workloads back from public clouds to private or hybrid setups. Over half of enterprises are repatriating some cloud workloads, seeking better control and cost efficiency. 
This hybrid approach, blending edge, private, and public resources, represents a more nuanced understanding of where different workloads belong. AI automation has evolved from handling individual tasks to orchestrating entire workflows. McKinsey estimates generative AI could add $4.4 trillion annually to the global economy through workflow automation. Legal contracts process themselves, medical records update automatically, and supply chains optimize without human intervention. This isn't about eliminating jobs, it's about amplifying human capability by removing friction from complex processes. The foundation for tomorrow's connected world is being laid today through edge computing and early 6G research. Edge computing processes data where it's generated, eliminating latency for real-time applications. South Korea, Japan, and Finland lead 6G development, promising speeds and reliability that will enable technologies we can barely imagine. Together, Edge and 6G will power everything from autonomous vehicles to holographic communications. As AI-generated content becomes indistinguishable from reality, verifying authenticity becomes critical. Blockchain-based digital IDs and decentralized verification systems are emerging as solutions. The EU develops digital identity wallets while projects like WorldCoin experiment with biometric verification. The digital identity market heads towards $70 billion by 2027, establishing trust frameworks essential for an AI-saturated world where distinguishing real from synthetic becomes increasingly difficult. These 20 technologies aren't developing in isolation. They're converging to create a future that arrives faster than most expect. The changes coming by 2026 won't announce themselves with fanfare they'll slip into daily life through updates, upgrades, and gradual adoption until one day you realize the world has transformed around you. The question isn't whether these changes will happen. It's whether you'll be ready when they do. That's it for today, folks. See you in the next video.